I'd love to hear from one person. Is there one person that has an expectation for somebody in their life that they'd actually like to have a breakthrough in? Nobody. Got it. Okay, great. I appreciate the commitment to your relationships. So we think about a person in your life that you have an expectation for. He should be this way. She should be this way. And then say that to yourself in your brain and see how you feel. So think about that person, say their name or their pronoun in your head, should, and then the expectation. Ready, set, go. Now, how do you feel? Do you feel great about that expectation that you put on that person? Or do you feel a little off, a little negative? So consider taking the word should out and put the word could in there. Try that sentence again. Instead of he should show up on time, consider he could show up on time. He should do what he said he was going to do. He could do what he said he was going to do. Try that on the expectation that you have for that person right now in your brain and see if there's a difference. Ready, pronoun, could, and then the expectation, go. Do you feel the same or do you feel different? Does that expectation benefit you? It doesn't. So one thing I request of you is whenever you notice that you're getting upset, consider most of the time you're just stuck in the matrix of your mind and you're running an expectation. So I ask you just to be nice to yourself because in reality, when you create expectations for others, you're the one that gets upset. Be nice. Notice the end in nice. Notice when you feel any way that you don't want to feel. And it's okay to feel any way that you want. We've been brought up to believe there's only certain ways of being that is, are okay. Growing up as a guy, I was taught that you're allowed to be angry, but you can't be sad. You can't cry in front of others or you're a blank, blank, blank. My sister was taught you're allowed to be sad, but if you're angry, if you're hysterical, if you're loud, oh, that's a no-no. Say people who are triggered by loud people. So consider for a moment, any way that you are is okay. And if you want to stop feeling a certain way, nice. Notice when you're upset or any way that you don't like to be. The I in nice. Investigate. What expectation did I create for this person or this situation? And the C and the E is change the expectation. If you do that, you will have so much more access to joy and happiness in your life 